Do you like torture porn? Because that's what you're going to get if you watch this show. Now, nah, maybe that's a little bit hard, but um, yeah, it was torture porn. I, I, I watched this show, and I didn't feel good about anything I saw. I didn't love anything. I didn't find any scenes in any particular episode that I want to go back to and rewatch. I didn't love any of the characters specifically. I wasn't in love with any of anything really it just felt bad i saw a lot of episodes where nothing happened i saw a lot of stuff that i'd never want to see again and overall this show just made me feel really horrible uh, i'm gonna give a lot of spoilers in this so it opens up with this really nice black family moving <coughs> to compton from somewhere in the south i don't remember um it's not important thing about georgia or something like that i don't know and they're moving from the south to live in Compton in the middle of the 1960s. Uh, their neighbors are these really interesting white sort of um, housewives. They're all very simple, very traditional. They have like the dresses and you know all that shit you used to see from the 1960s and 50s and all the movies. You know they got the whole grease thing going on. Seeing racism displayed like this on a television show is interesting because we rarely get to see this nice white collar and blue collar racism i feel like we usually get the the redneck southern version of racism and we rarely get this uh post-depression era clean cut west coast racism from clean cut apple pie white people i think this is uh cool to see this on tv because me as a guy who's from the south who moved up north to uh boston I noticed that the racism I experienced there was very similar to the stuff I saw on this show. It was very similar to the uh, behavior I saw from the white characters on this show. And even down to the weird part where they were in school and the students started making monkey sounds around the older black girl. That, yeah, you know, I've had that happen before. If you went to school in the South or you lived during any of that time, those were probably normal things for you if you, you know, were a person of color during that time period. Other than that, um, I just think this show did a really bad job of making me feel anything. There were some interesting magic aspects that I felt weren't really explored enough. There was a really interesting flashback scene that I honestly feel the show should have opened with instead of devoting an entire episode to right before the end because it felt like it was just sort of there to stop us from finishing the show yet you know they had another episode left they want to put a little break in there and you know give us something else to look at before the finale right but other than that this this thing was just non-redeemable in every single way and every version of that definition i like i said i, did, I didn't love the characters and love the settings i felt bad i if you who has anyone ever seen this show if you're watching this if you can find me one moment in that entire thing that that entire what 10 episodes where you felt some kind of comeuppance for the characters, because I just don't think it exists. I, I don't think there is any sense of, hey, I got my lick back, or hey, you hit me and I hit you too. Instead, I just watch it and I feel drained and disgusted and just, ugh, hopeless is the word. It's just a big, hopeless mess. Um, but, that's not to sit here and say it's the worst project I've ever seen in my life. It's a great series. It's a greatly made series. I just think the writing's trash. I want to watch something that makes me feel better. I don't want to continue to watch black minstrel shows in 2021, especially with all the horrible things we have going in the world. You watch something like this, where do you go? <laughs> How do you feel? And once again, to bring me to my first point in this video was who is it for? I don't think black people like this. I, I don't think black people will enjoy this. So do white people want to see this? Is this something that white people will enjoy? I want to know. I want to know who this show was for, what the intended audience was like, and maybe even what people thought when they watched this thing initially because I didn't love it. Um, what did you guys think in the comment section? Did you like, dislike, whatever? And uh, yeah, that's it.